it's me Sydney and welcome to Planet Sid. So if you're watching this then you already seen the title. <coughs> oh my god. I woke up at well I'm waking up at 6 a.m. to take Instagram pictures so I can catch the sunrise. And so it's like 6.50 something right now. I'm really tired. But it's still fucking dark outside. <laughs> The sun is rising. Anyways. Let me close the door. It's not fucking here. But yeah, it's 6.55 right now. I woke up. It took everything in my motherfucking soul, bitch, to get up. But I've been saying I wanted to get up and do this for like two weeks now. I've been procrastinating about getting up. And I was listening to this podcast and they were basically saying like when you set a precedent for yourself and you don't stick to it, that's a way of disrespecting your own boundaries and your time. So I'm gonna stick to it. So yeah, anyways, I'm about to get ready and do my makeup and all that other shit. I'm fucking tired. But you gotta do what you gotta do. So, yeah, if you guys are interested in seeing how this process goes, just stay tuned. And then also, <coughs> I packed all my clothes and everything in like a bag. And I picked out my outfits last night. So, when I'm ready, all I gotta do is just grab them and go. But, anyways, if you guys are interested in that, I'm naked because I sleep naked. But, anyways, if you guys are interested in that, then stay tuned. So, I was supposed to take these pictures yesterday. I did my makeup and got ready and everything. But for some reason, I thought that on the iPhone, like weather app, when it says sunset, I thought that that means like when it started setting. That was my cat. <laughs> but this scared me. Anyways, I thought that that meant like that it starts setting at whatever time but actually that means like the sun is already set so i got up did my makeup had a bag packed and everything went out to my car and i was like wait hold on it's kind of dark out here hold on and then i had to google when's the best time to take pictures and go an hour and it was after an hour after sunrise up to an hour after sunrise leo get down it was up to an hour after sunrise and an hour before sunset, so there's that for you guys. Next outfit, I'm going to wear these pants that is also a part of my outdoors collection. And these are made out of a kind of sweater knit rib material. It's very warm and it has a nice little stretch to it. And then it has this gold zipper in the front. I'm gonna wear these and they are straight leg. So I'm gonna wear those. And then I was waiting on Leo, what are you doing? Anyways. That's why I was waiting on these shoes to come in. Cause I just feel like they would look so good. Because I did have some black shoes, but I just feel like brown. Especially since it is like a croc print as well. I feel like these look really good with these. And I'm just gonna put some gold accessories since it already has like gold right here. I made some pants that are in these in the outdoors camo print and, you know their pants and they have like a little cut out on the left side so I'm just gonna take these as well I'm not really planning to fit around them I'm just gonna change into them just so I can get some good product pictures I'm going to wear my moss bikini top so this is a bikini they're matching bottoms as well, but I'm not going to wear like a bikini for the shoot. But um, they're, uh, th I'm going to wear the bikini top part of it. And this is in that same sweater print material. And this is called like the moss bikini, you know, like moss on the tree. And then it also has brown roping as well for the tie. So I'm going to wear this top.
with these, I don't know, what do they call this khaki? Brown khaki um, men's pants that I got from Boohoo Man. And they have, kind of have like that carnival feel, so I feel like that really look good with the whole outdoorsy. So I'm just gonna wear this with this and then some gold accessories. And then I'm gonna wear my Doc Martens. And then they have fur on the inside. These are platform and they're brown. This is what I like. I'm wearing it. Is this another? So I'm gonna take some pictures with just the bikini top and the pants. And then I'm also gonna take some with the sweater with the bikini top and the pants. It's the same, it's the moss sweater. And then if you look, I have a little clear button. So if you just button in the center, and then if you see the ends are like kind of curly. So yeah, this is just the moss sweater. So I'm just gonna take a few with that and then take a few without it just to see which ones I like. So those are the three outfits. Come on, bitch, I'm straight. Active. Okay, so it's time for the ball now. I'm about to get dressed and go. Yeah. Okay, so bitch, it is 8, 10 a.m. Now I'm about to head to my first location to start taking pictures. I'm wearing this big ass jacket because it's like 45 degrees outside and I'm fucking freezing. But I got my bags with all my different outfits. And so I'm just about to head to my first location. So I will see you guys there. So I just pulled up to my first location. I'm at the, um, oh, my phone looks weird. I'm at the, this parking garage I usually go to, but I've never been here like in the morning after the sun has risen. And it's kind of dark in here, so I'm just gonna go and stand like in one of the corners just to see if I can catch some light. I think it's mainly due to the fact that um, on this other side, it's a big ass church. And so I think that may be why it looks a little bit darker because it's like low key blocking the view. But let's see if we can catch some light. Okay, wait, hold on, I might be able to give me a little salt and sun. I mean, I guess. There's like sunlight in here. Oh yeah, right there. Oh my god. Fuck, what do I do? What do you mean? I think I'm gonna get a few pictures here because the light is down here, obviously. Maybe if I go to somewhere else, hold on. I'm just walking around here so it hurts. It's really not like it. Is this better? <laughs> it is. Okay, I'm gonna do it right here. Well, that was easy. Okay, so now I gotta, hold on. Now I gotta finish getting ready. Well, I am ready. I put on this big ass coat. This was a part of one of my outfits, but bitch, it was, ooh, hold on. Hold on, bitch. Hold on, bitch. Oh my God, it's so cold out here. But, I put on this coat because it's one of my out it's part of one of my outfits, but then it was cold as fuck outside as well. So you know, gotta be useful with your shit. I got like two bags full of different outfits. And I also have to change my shoes because I'm gonna wear these slides. But I didn't wear these at the house because it's like 40 degrees outside and I just went on my docks because my feet could at least be warm while I'm driving. So I'm just about to put on my shoes and then set up my tripod. Put on some lip gloss. Well, y'all can't even see me, but oh well, you can hear me. I'm 
and take these motherfucking photos. Okay, I just finished getting my first outfit together. So this is the top, some pants and I just put on this slide. I'm low-key dreading, oh Jesus Christ, I'm low-key dreading going out because it's fucking cold. I know, and I know my toes are going to be cold because I'm wearing sandals, but fuck it. Because I got to come up to get, so we're about to do that. I'm about to take these pictures set of my tripod and I also film like a TikTok or something. So I should take, oh wait, where's my clicker? Here it goes forget this but um i try and spend no more than 10 minutes out like i just go click away click away click away and then i usually find something within those so that's just how i do it because it's fucking cold and i got like five different outfits i need to take pictures in but anyways let's go take these fucking pictures Yo, yo shut the fuck up hey no bitch shut the fuck up tell your best friend shut the fuck up hey Okay, bitch, I just did my first outfit and they coming out so fucking good. Like the lighting is perfect. At first I was a little bit nervous. I was giving a little bit of an overcast with my lashes, just a tiny bit. But overall, they're coming out really good. So now I'm about to change into my next outfit and we are making good time. So I'm about to change my next outfit. So I'm not gonna do that on camera because like y'all need to see my titties. Okay, so I'm still changing but i'm gonna get this outfit i tried to shoot this outfit like two days ago but then this is why i'm here in the morning now because it was i tried to go at sunset and i just ran out of time and it was too dark and so i'm just gonna try and put these on my titties was out for a second you know i have to put on the triangle top also this is main character the label from my outdoors collection so shop if you're a bad bitch i made this myself designed it anyways I think I'm gonna take like two this outfit and then one more outfit up here in the garage I'm still gonna like look for like different spaces within the garage but then I also want to try and find some other places like some plain walls and just some different textures around this general area that I'm in because I don't want all of my pictures on my Instagram to be in just one spot because that gets boring and we're trying to grow so oh my god changing in your car is so I feel like I'm living in here. Oh my god. Okay, y'all don't need to see all this in this, but but the titties are heaving. They're very much heaving. Oh my god, I'm trying to hurry up. Even though I don't even know why I'm tripping because there's really nobody in here. It's like two cars parked in here, but I think this is a parking garage for a hotel. So like niggas is asleep right now. Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay, we almost got this one on. Wait, I'm going to wear this with some, what do they call it, khaki? Some tan men's pants that I got from Boohoo Man. In a size small, they're kind of cargo-like. I feel like it'll go with the vibe of this top. And then also, I really like these pants because I can tie them up top and adjust them. Bitch, this is a photo about me taking Instagram pictures. Why am I talking about the clothes that I'm wearing? Anyways, I just thought I'd give y'all an update. So I'm putting on my third outfit, the Kill Bill dress. My the Kill Bill dress by me, only at main character's the label. But I'm putting on my third dress, and I'm making pretty good time. It's taking longer than I thought it would, but I have work at noon. Oh, Jesus Christ. And I'm making pretty good time. Hold on, bitch. I'm trying to put on. Oh, shit. Okay. And I'm making pretty good time. <laughs> Um, it's taking me a little bit longer than I thought it would. I guess it's just because I have to change into like five or six different outfits in the car, which is, I'm not going to say it's time consuming, but it takes longer than if I were changing like in my room or something. But that's as expected. Um, but so I'm making a pretty good time. I think it's like not even 930 yet. And honestly, as long as I'm done before 11, I'm good. And I'm pretty sure I will be. I honestly think I'll be done within the next half hour or so. Because I do still have like a few more outfits to get. I have to take some product pictures. And then I also have to um, 
just take one more like outfit outfit and so I think this is the last picture I'm going to take in the garage and I think with the other two or three well two and a half three because I like one actual outfit and then two that are just plain casual outfits well not casual but I'm taking those as product pictures for my brand because my outdoors collection comes out this Friday on the 25th I don't know if this will be out by then <sighs> but this is the last one I'm gonna take because I just feel like with the lines in here it's gonna really set it off with the dress so but anyways we're making good time just thought I'd give you all a little update <laughs> pictures and I just realized that I am for real like that bitch like I really need to stop playing with myself and sitting on myself because these pictures are magnificent and I honestly yellow is my color anyways I just have to share them with y'all because I just feel so good after ooh, bitch I'm going up here let me see it after having after going through like low self-esteem and just life in general and just having poor self-image but then finally realizing that I'm at the place where I feel so comfortable, so good, valid, and worthy in my skin. That is such a great feeling. Bitch, I could literally cry right now. I'm not gonna do that because I still got pictures to take and my makeup is fucking late. But just know, this is a great feeling. New things that make you happy. I just got done with outfit three and I just feel so freaking good because these pictures are coming out so good and after a lifetime of thinking like I wasn't photogenic and also just struggling with self-image and low self-esteem and just life in general and just having a poor self-image it feels really good to like look at myself in a picture or just like look at myself in the mirror and feel valid beautiful worthy and just like that bitch because I'm me and I, I don't need anybody to tell me that. I mean, if you want, if you want to tell me, I'm listening. But it feels nice to feel. It feels nice to have self validation and just to know I'm that bitch just because I am. And everybody is that bitch. You are the main character. I'm the main character. You're all the main character. Main character label. <laughs> but um, I don't know. It's just such a good feeling, and I just feel like I've been sleeping on myself for so long. But I'm so grateful to have arrived at this point to just feel just so beautiful. And it's like without the hair, makeup, all that shit. Like I still feel so valid and worthy of good things, happiness, love, joy, peace, and abundance. So we're like a year ago or just all throughout my life. Like I could not say that. And I'm just so grateful even though this is this is a fucking video about how I take Instagram pictures. And here I am giving a fucking sermon and a life story. But bitch. I don't know. And then I was also watching this podcast. This is very random. But I was watching this podcast. And basically they were saying like. You gain more respect for yourself when you do things that you say you're going to do for yourself. And you lose respect for yourself when you don't. So when you procrastinate and just fall into the traps of like laziness. And this self-sabotaging habits. And um, having imposter syndrome. Like all those things are valid. But then when you say. Like me personally, I've been saying I was going to wake up at 6 a.m. and then do my makeup early in the morning so I can get these pictures before work. Because by the time I get off work, I <laughs> the sun is down and then also I have to wait until my off days. And on my off days, what if I want to sleep and I would have other shit to do? So I've been telling myself I was going to get this shit done for like two weeks. But I've been procrastinating so bad because I don't want to get up. And then also, I just did not want to get up. And I wasn't being the best with my time management to make sure that I was well rested enough to be able to to get up and everything so i won't be tired but basically it was in the to my sisters podcast i would just put a screen cap on it a screen grab or whatever but basically when i say i'm gonna do something i'm gonna wake up tomorrow i'm gonna do it i'm gonna do it i'm gonna do it but then when i don't you start to lose trust in yourself and that could be applied to anything but when you start to lose trust in yourself 
you don't validate yourself and you don't have high respect or a high self-esteem like it just it's a ripple effect into how you view yourself and also if you hold yourself accountable so i just i just feel so good because this is an act of self-love and respect for myself along with just me just looking like a bad bitch because come on look at the material but yeah i just thought i'd share that little nugget of knowledge with you guys for the day so bitch oh my god i mean it's 11 05 i think i'm about to take off my makeup because i have to go to work at noon I'm sorry, y'all. I'm looking at my reflection in the mirror, but it's 11.05, so I'm taking off my makeup, but today was very, very, very successful, and I feel really good. I just took off my lashes, so that made me where I look kind of weird, but yeah, so you guys should for sure take your Instagram pictures if you like this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, and thank you guys for watching if you guys stayed this long. <laughs> Also, be sure to follow me at my business page uh, for my clothing brand, main character, the label, and my makeup brand, Box Office Beauty. And be sure to follow me on Instagram and all platforms at underscore planet soon. And thank you guys for watching.